Hi there, thanks for checking out this Vive education video. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your Vive Mars Cam Track. Let's get started. Vive Mars Cam Track is an out of the box plug and play camera tracking solution that allows you to set up a camera for virtual production in a matter of minutes. In addition to the included hardware components, you'll need an IP router and a PC equipped with a virtual production tool such as Unreal Engine. The first thing you'll need to do is set up Mars. First, connect Mars to your PC using an IP router. To do this, connect one end of the short LAN cable to the PC LAN port on Mars and then connect the other end to your router. Then connect Mars to a power outlet using the included AC adapter and power cord and press the power button. Now it's time to set up the rovers. Mount a Vive tracker onto a rover so that they're properly aligned and then tighten the assembly screw. Then connect them using one of the short USB cables. Next, connect the rover to Mars using one of the long LAN cables. The rover should turn on automatically. Make sure to keep track of which Ethernet port on Mars the rover is connected to. Check the Mars dashboard to confirm that the rover is detected. Now you're ready to set up the base stations. Face each base station toward the center of the tracking area where you plan to set up the calibration board. Connect the base stations to power one at a time. Make sure the first base station is detected by Mars before connecting the second one. If Mars doesn't automatically detect the base stations, press the channel button on the back to set the channel manually. Depending on your network setup, Unreal Engine may automatically detect Mars and its IP address. If Mars isn't automatically detected, you'll have to manually add it as an endpoint in Unreal Engine. Now we're going to show you how to add Mars as an endpoint in Unreal Engine. You can skip this section if Unreal Engine automatically detected Mars during setup. In Unreal Engine, click Edit, then go to Project Settings, Plugins, UDP Messaging, and scroll down to find Static Endpoints. Click the plus, then enter the Mars IP and port number. The Mars IP is displayed on the Mars dashboard. Tap the network icon to open the network settings, where you'll find the port number. To enable the LiveLink plugin, select LiveLink from the window menu to open the LiveLink client. Click the Add Source button, then go to Message Bus Source and select the Vive LiveLink plugin. You should then be able to see Mars data being pushed to Unreal Engine. Now you can set up the calibration board. Attach the base supports to the calibration board and then attach a rover module to the board under the chessboard pattern. Make sure the rover module is securely attached to the calibration board. Any gaps between the board and the module could affect calibration. Place the calibration board inside the tracking area at the same height as the camera with the camera facing the board at a 90 degree angle. Make sure the calibration board doesn't obscure the rover module from the base stations after rotating at 45 degrees in either direction. This will be important during camera calibration. Also make sure that the calibration board is well lit and that your camera's ISO is low. You can also attach the rover module to a tripod for greater precision during calibration, which will improve tracking performance. Now you're ready to calibrate your camera. Before getting started, make sure to output your camera's video feed to your computer's video capture card. Attach a rover module to your camera. Make sure the front side of the rover is parallel to the camera lens. Open the camera calibration tool on your PC. Enter the Mars IP and then click Connect. Under Video Source, select your video capture device from the drop-down menu. Then select a destination folder for the data that the camera calibration tool will collect. Click the play button at the bottom of the screen to start calibrating. 
Move the camera so the chessboard pattern falls inside the red frame. The frame will turn blue, and the camera calibration tool will capture an image. Move the camera as needed to capture additional images. After you've captured enough images, you'll be prompted to rotate the calibration board 45 degrees. After rotating the board, click Continue and repeat the image capture process. After capturing a second set of images, you'll be prompted to rotate the board 45 degrees in the opposite direction. Rotate the board, then click Continue and capture the third and final set of images. After you capture the final set of images, the camera calibration tool will process the data and display the calibration results. Click Export, then follow the on-screen instructions to export the data in a format that's suitable for your virtual production engine. Import the data into your virtual production engine to sync the camera with your virtual environment. Follow the same procedure to set up additional cameras. Vivemars CamTrack is all set up and ready to go. Now you can get a head start on making your vision a reality. Hi again, thanks for watching. We hope you found this video helpful. If you're interested in learning more about the Vibe Mars Cam Track or other Vibe products, make sure to check out the other videos in this channel. I'll see you next time.